sitting here with my boyfriend and my face popped up on the screen. And then it kind of hit me what had actually happened. Deepfake videos, which are manipulated using AI, can make someone appear as though they're saying or doing something that they're not. Once these images are online, they never truly go away. The detective that got assigned to the case, he said that it's disgusting what happened, but the person had a right to do it. Like, they didn't break any laws. And then they told me they had closed the case. I kept asking myself, why would someone want to do this? And who would do this? OK, all I have to say right now is holy shit. About 20 minutes ago, I found out that I know the other girl who this is happening to. This is definitely a weird situation that we're in. I'm just more mad that they like put my name out there. So we whittled down the suspects based on who we both knew. Wait, I, I know her. Oh my god, that's Sadie. It's definitely him then. There's no way. The fact that the group of women is this big, it scares me because I have a gut feeling that we haven't even found all of them. There is no woman in the world who is safe from this technology. I'm worried that they're gonna do something more drastic. You were also targeted by this kid that targeted me. I'm very tired of ignoring it. I believe that in his mind, he's getting back at us for wronging him. I now know his name, where he lives. I'm angry. You can't just do this and then move on with your life.